My name is uh, Gabriel Vasquez, and uh, who I am, hopefully someone doing good things for my community. As you can see, this is iron like this is flame. That right there is real. I like this a lot. Montana, spray paint is the best. Art is the combination of passion, insight, and heart. I couldn't tell you, you know, who we compare against outside of El Paso, but I'll tell you right now, El Paso, Texas holds it down on the art circuit. Now this right here, bro, this is when you're trying to get out of there before the cops come. All right, this is the hardcore back cow. Yo, this one's so cool. And in El Paso, Texas, art has never been louder than through Gabriel. This is the community that I grew up in. You know, I've been doing this for 15 and a half years, committed with everything I have. Okay, it's taking a major step back. Taking a major step back away from it so you can see it all. Because right here you can't. This community, regardless of its personality, has a very strong art community. So strong to the point where uh, it's on Kobe's face. I am pushing myself my hardest every single time just to even be a part of it. Just over a year ago, Gabriel City stopped. Well, I was in my backyard, you know, doing a project like I do. And um, my mom told me, hey, Gabe, what? There's some dudes shooting people up at Walmart right now. Just don't go anywhere. A mass shooting at Walmart killed 23 people. And when his city needed him most, Gabriel was sent to create one of his most notorious murals. It says El Paso strong. What does this mean to you, what you're doing? Making God happy because he gave me the gift to do it and an opportunity to do it well. Gabriel's mural, El Paso Strong, rallied his city to come together. Seen by people all over the world, El Paso Strong became the motivation for his city to heal. I didn't do it for the world. I, I did it for my city because I hold it down for my city. I ride hard for my city. I don't know these people. I don't know any of them. But you know what? The people who do that came and told me their stories is when it hit so deep that it became real for me because it wasn't real for me in my backyard, you know? A year later, Gabriel's peace is still here. He keeps it alive, coming back every so often to put fresh paint on the mural that brought the city together after something it may never fully heal from. I think we're scarred for life, and we're dealing with it. As far as a comeback, it doesn't matter. Because what are we coming back from? This kind of thing happens all over the world. We're not special, okay? What's special is what we do together. And what they do together is stay strong. El Paso, strong. I'm Thomas Hoppo reporting.